division. The last time you determined who the next mayor of the KCC was. I want you to right that wrong this time. I want you to support Comrade Sean McGregor. I want you to do it early. Intense battle for the Kingston and St. Andrew Municipal Corporation. This is a cover story, local government election watch. Let's get after it. But before we do, I invite you to subscribe, share, comment, and like this video. There is a fiercely contested battle for control of the Kingston and St. Andrew Municipal Corporation. People's National Party leader Mark Golding is leaving no stone unturned. With memories of the razor-thin margin in the Raytown division during the 2016 local government elections haunting the party, Golding understands the gravity of the situation. The 26th is a vital date for Jamaica. It's a vital date for the Kingston and St. Andrew Municipal Corporation. It's a vital day for Raytown. Last time it Raytown decided how the KSAC got. And by one vote, it went the wrong way. So so we know so we have to take it extra serious right here. So there's no Roman boom business on election day, it's a serious business. We need every PNP supporter to come out and vote for Sean McGregor, X beside the head. And comrades, I've been traveling all over the island and the energy for the PNP is there. Our people are energized. Our people want to see us back in power. And so they're prepared to stand up and deal with the matter. And I encourage each and every one here, whether it be from East Kingston and Port Royal side, Central Kingston side, Almantown or Raytown, please take this one serious because history will be made and you will be part of making that history. And we need to turn the table on them. Jamaica needs a PNP back in office. A government with integrity. A government looking out for the people who need help. A government that you can rely on to build institutions to support the needy, to support the vulnerable, to, the, to support the masses of the people. We are the party that gave you the National Housing Trust, that gave you the National Health Fund, that gave you the PATH program, that gave you the Drug for the Elder program, that gave you all the highways in the country, and the liberals have just picked up the pieces and continued. But they don't know what they're doing because they had a throne speech today and there was no vision in it. It fell flat. So comrades, 26 please. X beside the head. I have every confidence in River. I believe he will be an excellent counselor. One love, comrades. God bless you all. Golding is on a tireless campaign trail, rallying support and shoring up the division to prevent history from repeating itself. For McGregor, the pressure is on as he gears up for a crucial rematch against seasoned politician Rosalie Hamilton in the upcoming election. Still reeling from his previous defeat by a mere single vote, McGregor knows that this contest is make or break for his aspirations of becoming the mayor of Kingston and St. Andrew. Hamilton is no stranger to politics. She first won the division in 2003 before losing it in 2012 and then reclaiming it in the 2016 local government election. For McGregor, a victory is not just a desire but a necessity, a pivotal step towards achieving his ultimate goal. My town! My town! Them think me they done. Them think me they done. Come me just a come. Come with any of the other people them. I said them have right on lock. But we step in and say river have the key. And we got to walk late on February 26. They must be at a beat now. Left, right and center come with. Left, right and center come with. Comrades, the last time a lot of people say we won a nice campaign, them say a lot of big crowds, and so on, them say River Garden is already, them now about a vote. I don't want to make that mistake again. Anybody hear me? We don't want to make that mistake again. So on the morning of February 26th, 
put on the clothes, put on an orange shirt, bright and early like a working nigga. You mean business? Because the business of the people's national party is serious business. It's the business of Jamaica. We tell them the right. I'm tired of the labor pain. On Monday, February 26, you are going to send the first signal that time has come to get rid of Andrew Ones and his miserable men. As the countdown to election day begins, all eyes are on this tightly contested race where every vote will undoubtedly shape the future landscape of local governance. And that was Cover Story Highlights Election Watch. Tune in again next time for another edition of Cover Story Election Watch. In the meantime, please subscribe, like, share and drop your comments below.